So this one, I've not seen this on a frame. That doesn't mean it doesn't happen, but I haven't seen it. And that's straw work. Now you normally see something like that on little trinket boxes. You get little tiny pieces of straw, cut them up and create some sort of either geometric pattern or maybe even different colours if you stain it. I uh, haven't got any straw, but I do have um, this weird waxed string thing. Um, so what I'm going to do is draw out, I think a bird shape, because we haven't, we haven't had a bird on our tree yet. Use the string um, and then once I've done that, then I'll figure out what sort of gilding technique I'm going to do on it. Because it's waxed, I can't do water gilding, so it will have to be colner or oil gilding. So let's get on with that. So I've drawn out the robin, I've got my string and some scissors, I really want a fast drying glue but I haven't really got anything so I'm going to be using the normal fish glue that I use, although this is going to get really messy and sticky I think. I'm just going to start uh, with the beak. So I'm going to seal the bird with some button polish. I still haven't decided how I'm going to gild it yet, but however I do, it does need sealing. I think I'm going to cut it off the card, as in, sorry, cut around it. So I've cut the bird out, now I'm going to do this in three colours. I think I'm going to oil two of them and try and colner one of them. So this could get a bit messy, um, the gold tends to stick anywhere it wants to. Um, Alright, let's give this a go then. So I'm using the three hour oil size. Doing 3.5 carat loose gold.
I've got some six carat white gold loose. Um, I think a robin has a little bit of a white underneath here, so that's what this white gold is going to be. Hopefully it won't attach to the other gilding. If it does, I'll have to just deal with that. So the plan was to do three different leaf colours, the normal gold, the white gold, and then I wanted to use this, this red gold, but there isn't actually that much difference between the gold and the red gold. Perhaps if I'd got some rose gold, but I don't have any of the rose gold, so I'm actually just going to leave it like that because it looks pretty much like a robin. I'm quite pleased with the way that's turned out. Um, it's a shame because I'd have liked to have seen what the corner looked like on there, but yeah, I'm just going to put uh, some ribbon so I can hang it and then put it on the tree.